This is Mike Callahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome to your Butterscotch.com tutorial on what is a file extension. Now, a file extension, also called a file name extension, is defined here on Wikipedia. It's the last three characters that follow a period in a file name. Under graphical systems like Windows, extensions have been used to associate with a program. So, for example, a doc file is associated with Word, XLS is associated with Excel, and so on. Now here on filext.com, it's a great resource to look up file extensions and more when you don't know what program created a certain file. There are many, many, many proprietary file extensions, and this is a great resource to find out where they are. Now the original naming convention under DOS was eight character file name and a period and then up to a three character file extension like here one through eight period one two three now there are some file extensions like the new zip x format that are four characters there are some that are two under windows long file names became very popular but extensions primarily remained three characters some programs will show you file extensions. For, this, for example, this is Directory Opus, a file manager. It shows you .txt, .exe, .chm, .ini, .url, .ico. And when you know file extensions, you can see that this is an executable, this is an icon, this is a URL, this is an initiation file, this is an executable, this is a text file. Text file, in this case, is associated with Notepad++. But when I click on it, it automatically opens in the associated program. So file extensions are extremely useful, extremely important. You can have multiple associations under Windows. So these are file extensions, and that's all there is to it.